Hello, I'm Dave. Welcome to my Technical Notes channel. Continuing this series of learning the Arduino IDE library syntax, the rules. In this part three, we'll learn how the scope resolution operator is. In this example, I'm going to define three variables, each called temperature. So to begin with, one is defined in the class float temperature equals 33.8. Then there's a sketch global variable, float temperature equals 22.1. And then later on within a function, there's a local variable called temperature assigned a value 28.7. So how do we use the scope resolution operator? Well, in the function read temperature, we can print the local variable as normal. It will print 28.7. Then we can use the scope resolution operator to print the global variable called temperature and then the class value of temperature because we've prefixed it with my sensor colon colon, which is again the scope resolution operator says use my class to get the variable value. When we include a library, my sensor.h in this example. What that does is to include the class definition. In this case, it's been called sensor. And then sensor colon colon tells a compiler that the function reading in the sensor.cpp has been defined in the class called sensor. So I'm trying to depict there how the H file links to the CPP file so that when it comes to usage in your sketch prefixing with the class name uh, or, or class name with colon colon if it's used in the scope resolution context helps define where that value is defined itself. So Double colon is the scope resolution operator. All CPP functions must be prefixed with the class name scope resolution. And in the next part of this series, we'll look at library files and the use of the chevron and quote, double quote directors. I hope you found this technical note interesting and useful. 